Several students of Beacon Junior School were exposed to science, technology, and innovation with food and nutrition. Sustainability and security being the focus during an agri-hub initiative. This initiative has been ongoing for more than three years in schools across the island. The program is important for the school's curriculum development, says Dwayne Mitchell, lead consultant of the eAgriHub Curriculum Support Services. But most importantly, towards the student learning, toward the academic uh, development, as they start the new school term um, come September. So we are doing a pre-learning uh, program with them with the introduction of science, technology and innovation. So they are, they are applying those learning principles to prepare them for September and the new school year as a matter of fact. So there is, we're bridging that gap, that learning gap that, that, that exists within our education system so that they can be well-rounded students. Prince Stanislaus and Devoni Rache, students enrolled in the program, tell of how the program can benefit them now and throughout their lives. Putting me because I am learning that and I can teach other people how that we can preserve and keep food security upheld. It boosts our food production by um, by letting the pollinators do what they need to do. It boosts, it actually boosts most, most raw fruits and raw plants. Principal of the institution, Dr. Cheryl Bunnaby Bishop, believes the integration of these important areas will foster greater learning. To be quite honest with you, I, I am I'm fascinated right now. I'm, I'm also elated because um, we're in the 21st century and learning in our classrooms really have to change, must, must change. And so the whole idea, because technology has certainly changed the scope of, of learning, the scope of, of, of almost everything. And um, it's important for our children now to see the link between what their, their traditional subject areas that they're, they're accustomed to cover and now see how technology can now integrate all of them. For GBN News, I am Rena Pet Thomas reporting.